Good morning, everybody. Saturday morning here. Got made a little progress yesterday. I didn't get much filming done. Uh, I was running around a good bit. Went out and grabbed myself, you know, a couple boards here. These are two by tens. And so I assembled the form yesterday a little bit, and then I came out a little later and then started to dig out my footer around on the inside. So I've got three sides done, these two here and then the one behind me. So today we're going to finish up. I'm going to get the rest of this footer dug out. Um, then I really kind of got to get into final final prep. I'm going to lay some lay some plastic. I got a bunch of rebar here. I've got to get tied up, set in place. And then yeah, then uh then we'll be good to go. So that's kind of what I'm working on today. Not really too difficult of a day. Just more shoveling rock. It seems to be the story of my life right now. But uh, that's good, though. I'm able to make progress. We got so we're in like a winter storm warning right now. Where we we're at, so I'm gonna try and get as much done as I can today. Probably cover this over and then come back on Monday. Maybe we'll see what the weather's like. Rebecca today will be driving around the the cabins picking up a lot of the sticks and debris and the brush and stuff like that. So she she enjoys getting out of the house as much as she can. So all right guys, that's what's going on. See you in a bit. Well, good morning everybody. It's Monday morning here, day after the Super Bowl. Chiefs, I don't know what year you're going to see this, but the Chiefs beat up on the Eagles last night in the last uh last second field goal to win the game so we're out here getting it done now and uh, this is kind of what we're looking like so i got the plastic laid all right i had to join it together that's that black line going across that's just some gorilla tape stitching it together now i'm starting to lay out and tie together the rebar so it's about 18 inch squares through here and that's what this is going to look like. So, you know, it's just a rough layout right now. I've got to start stitching it together. And then, you know, we'll fill in kind of where we need. Um, as it's sitting right now, I have it filled. I'm probably going to have to use three more sticks. And I've got uh, three, six, seven, eight, eight more sticks sitting here on the ground. So I've got plenty, plenty left. And of course I still have to I still have to finish that uh, pad over there. That of course is for the cistern. And that's a hundred by a hundred inches. So I've got to get that dug out and get that rebarred and plasticed over and stuff like that. So we're we're kind of moving there. Hopefully today I will have both of these pads plastic and rebarred and yeah we're gonna go from there so i'm just starting to start and look at the weather kind of long term if it takes a week and a half to get concrete here uh you know looking at a 10-day forecast really kind of tough so anyway that's where we're at that's what i'm doing today and yeah we'll get at it all right guys just about the end of the day here i just wanted to catch you up on what kind of happened today so main sawmill pad is just about done i've got the the, the primary rebar i'm still going to go around and put some i got to go get more rebar but i'm going to have a double string through the footer around around the pad so i need to finish up with that i'm going to go pick that stuff up tomorrow but this one is all but really close to done all right, let me let me show you how things ended up over here. This wasn't too bad either. I mean, obviously it's much smaller. It's only a hundred by a hundred, and uh, I got three pieces of rebar left. That's all I had left uh, from that pile that I picked up the other day. Plus, I grabbed a one that was off off the barn that had been used for some of the footers down down by some of the cabins. So. So this one's 
you know, working its way to being done as well. I got plastic over it. I've got the footer and, you know, it's just gonna, it's gonna mirror what I have over there for the sawmill pad. Uh, so I, yeah, tomorrow I'm gonna make a run. I'm gonna pick up some more rebar. Rebar, some chairs for the footers, and then, yeah, that's uh, that's gonna be it. We'll have this, we'll definitely have both of these up and done tomorrow. Tomorrow's probably gonna be the last somewhat decent day early this week, it looks like. Wednesday, Thursday are going to be pretty rainy and, and Friday, I guess. So Saturday, Sunday, Monday looking like pretty good days. That being the case, I was just inside a little bit ago for lunch and lunch and things and I ordered my concrete. So that is coming 2 p.m. on Monday. So that will, by close of business on Monday, I will have a lot of concrete sitting here in some forms. Um, that, and I'm not uh, anticipating any any real problems with that now we do have some rain uh, coming in so I'll probably just have to cover things but overnight temperatures are only going to be in the mid 40s and stuff so that's great because we've been doing a lot of a lot of kind of diving into you know below freezing and stuff and that's that's no good for concrete setting so yeah that's it <laughs> that's it we got to make a supply run tomorrow we're going to finish up these uh, all this rebar and stuff tomorrow and then we're just going to be hanging out waiting until Monday. I may may have some other things in the works uh, down by the cabins. We'll have to see how well it's going to really depend on the weather and uh, well how wet I want to get. So all right guys thanks for hanging out. There's an update. We'll see you later.